this conference is important because it is time uh, to put uh, higher on the agenda of the international community the issue of the implication of climate change for security. Um, uh, climate change uh, is a long-term challenge, I think, for humanity in general. It uh, may become an existential threat uh, for life on the planet, so we need to take it seriously. And of course, uh, by the time uh, that we will see uh, more clearly the implications of this, it will be late. So we need to anticipate uh, the problems and start addressing them now. Uh, what we need to do because of the complexity of this challenge is really build the partnerships uh, involving countries, involving international organizations, involving the civil society and parliaments, etc. And, uh, and of course develop, uh, look at climate change and implication of climate change for everything we do. Uh, so develop policies uh, uh, dealing with you know, energy for instance taking uh, a, a climate change friendly approach in a way in these policies and the same applies to dealing with water issues or agriculture. The question of migrations, for instance, that we see in these, uh, these days, of course it's very obviously related to conflict, that's why we have uh, refugees and migrants coming over, but there is also a climate change angle that should not be ignored and over time the risk is that uh, uh, the impact of, uh, uh, of change in the environment will be felt more and more and, uh, and therefore there will be more migrants coming. So we need to develop policies also that help countries and the resilience of countries to climate change uh, so that we can create better conditions for, for people in the places where they live. I think what we uh, need to do is really to mobilize uh, public opinion, uh, uh, to mobilize also governments and to uh, uh, have in every international organization uh, uh, looking at uh, the kind of policies uh, that are required uh, to address, to focus on these challenges and to address them. Uh, so we in, in the OSC as a regional organization uh, under Chapter 8 of the Charter of the United Nations, it is important to look at the uh, global agenda of the UN, which is the Sustainable Development Agenda, and look in which respects uh, an organization like ours can work to implement, uh, uh, to, to implement this agenda. Um, uh, once again, uh, I would say the key is to mobilize uh, the uh, uh, governments, to mobilize the public opinion, uh, to find uh, the uh, will to move forward uh, towards policies that will be costly uh, because obviously uh, it's going to be an investment for the international community but an investment whose returns on the long term will be positive for all.